All right, guys, how's it going? I hope you're doing very well. Very easy tutorial today. Basically showing you how to set up light groups inside of Blender. Now, if you've never done this before, essentially what it does is it exports out the light inside of the render pass. It gives you a lot more control. You can tweak the light and colour. You can control the intensity, stuff like this, inside of the compositor. And it is really easy to set up, and I'll quickly show you this. So if we go to the view layers here on the right hand side and come all the way down the bottom you can see that we have light groups so i'm going to set up a light group here i'll hit the plus sign and i'm going to call this light one the next thing i'm going to do is i'm going to create another group we'll call this light two and three now the reason that i'm doing this is i want to show you you can actually group more than one light together so it doesn't necessarily need to be every single light so next, what I'm going to do is select the light on the right hand side, this purple light. And I'm going to go to the object properties and I'm going to come all the way down to shading. And what you'll see here is we have light group. If we open this up, we can select the group that we created. So in our case, light one. I'll then select this light and that'll be group two and three. And I'll select the last light and that'll be two and three as well. And when I go to render, I'll now get the render pass out and I essentially have the lights and I'll show you this. But first of all, what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to go back to the view layers and I'm going to enable the normal pass. It's just so I can do something in the compositor more than anything. And I'll hit F12 to render. And I'll quickly show you these layers. So once this is rendered, I'll go to the view layers and you can see here combined light 1, which will be a nice kind of purple light, really nice fall off here as well. And combined light 2 and 3. And you'll notice that it's blue and kind of green highlight here. What I can then do is I can go into the compositor, I can enable use nodes and we'll get all our lights here. So just to quickly show you, drop down a viewer node and we'll just quickly put this into the image. Cool. So what I can do essentially is I can start to mix these. So let's drop down something like a mix node. And let's just quickly put these two images in together. And you'll notice if I actually kind of put the factor down, you get a really nice mixture. But what I can also use is a normal that I created. Uh, so let's drop down a normal. And let's take the normal from here. And let's take the dot and put this into the factor. And let's just quickly mix something together so you get this really nice effect. But anyway, that's pretty much the basics of light groups. Any questions, if I've made an arse of anything, let me know down below. Anyway, you know what to do. Take care.